setting foot to Taiwan, it's mostly about immigration and waiting. So straight from the airport, we are now heading to Tu Chi Foundation to get our lunch. So, you know, at least we would have a, um, a taste immediately of what Taiwan has to offer. So as you can see in this view is the road. It will take us 45 minutes and here we are. We are having our lunch here in Taipei. <laughs> Alright, so we are now eating our lunch. In First our... lunch in Taiwan. Yes! So what can you say about your food, Christian? It's kind of different from the food that I... Art! I don't know. You go, dude. I mushroom. It's fried. So, after lunch, we will now go straight ahead to Hualien County by their train. So, they said it will take us two hours for this trip. But imagine the distance is like from Manila to Ilocos. So, their train here in Taiwan is really fast. After two hours, we will go straight ahead to Chu Chi Temple, have a quick tour and then go to the hotel rest tomorrow's gonna be our first performance let's go so welcome to hualien the least populated place in taiwan as you can see almost zero people look at these tired faces hey there mom i know for sure that these are gonna go straight ahead to bed if they hit the hotel So we are now entering the Tu Chi Temple, our host. Tu Chi Foundation, hello. So we, our host for this trip is Tu Chi Foundation, a Taiwanese nonprofit organization that provides relief to those who are in need. So we're going to have a quick tour inside their museum to know more about their culture and history. So they practice Buddhism because they're. Uh, founder was actually a Buddhist monk, so let's go and check it out. So we are now inside the main place of worship, where we can see the stages of Buddha. And yeah, it's so huge. <laughs> We're gonna take our breakfast for today. <laughs>
After singing at the Chuchi Hospital, we will now go straight ahead to the Chuchi abode and have a private lunch with Master Cheng Yen. Just amazing about the technology and of course, um, touring around Suchi Foundation. It's um, something that we can bring back home and teach our people to do the same thing, to be selfless and to be able to uh, have more compassion and have um, a better um, perspective by being uh, generous and uh, uh, minding the needs of the others before yourself. Day three. We're officially back in Taipei, and let's go. <laughs> it was freezing, 10 degrees Celsius, and it's raining, and we only have subway food here. 